parents, teachers, and all my friends. My name is Amy. Today, I'm going to tell you a story about Little Red Riding Hood. Once upon a time, there lived a girl named Little Red Riding Hood. She was very pretty. She she loved playing outside the courtyard. One day, her mom told her, "Sweetie, you know your grandma is ill. Could you bring some biscuits and some herbs? I picked from the forest." Of course, mom," said Little Red Riding Hood. Then to and then her mother tell her to not talk to him. Don't leave the path in the bunny forest. And then she go, it go arrive to her grandma house. On the way, she met a lot of beautiful flowers. There are lots of kind of flowers. When she is picking the flowers, she don't know she is lost in her way. Then, when she is picking flowers, she sounds a noise behind a bush. A big bad wolf appeared. When she see the big bad wolf, she drop her basket. The wolf, the wolf, come close to her and collect the cookies. She had dropped. Little Red Riding Hood is made of this blanket just for on the wolf. Little Red Riding Hood is like, thank you. The wolf is like, where are you going? To my grandma's house. She's not feeling well, so I bring cookies and healthy herbs. Her, the wolf say. Where do you where uh, where do you where my leaves? At the end of the forest, of the yellow house over there. She pointed. So the bull then when the a uh, hand uh, the appeared on the shot shot. The wolf ran as quickly as his can. So she the little bit riding hood. No, she is lost, and then she she started to cry under a tree. She cried, and the hunter hear her. But then she said, "Where are you going? It's very dangerous." The little red riding hood says, "I'm going to run my grandma's house, and I get lost." He she is so sad. She don't listen to her um her mommy. And then she tells him, "Uh, ah, uh, I guess I going to I bring cookies to my grandma, and I got a lot." Uh, so the hunter says, "I can bring you there." So the hunter and little red running coat goes to run house. When the wolf take a shortcut, and then and then he 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 walked, and then he knocked. On the door, well, in, inside Rama answered, "Who is it?" It's the wolf changed his voice. It's Rama. It's me, Little Red Riding Hood. The door is open. You can come inside," said Grandma. The wolf come inside and eat Grandma, and then the wolf is cast into Rama. When Little Red Riding Hood is arrived at Grandma's house, the hunter say, "Goodbye, Red Riding Hood. Give your Grandma a big hug and get her some cookies you you have learned and some healthy herbs." And then she go inside. The wolf disguised as Grandma. She she closed the shutters. And the window, so it's get dark in there. So you will run who don't know what she she, she she the wolf the the wolf says. Come here, let me get a hug. 
but no way Ryan will do the basket on the floor. The wolf say, Close, Simon. Closer, but little red rider, don't get too close because her rama look a bit not like her. She say, "What big ears you have, Granny! Oh, the better to see you with what big ears you have. Oh, the better to hear you, and what big long hands you have. Oh, the better to hear you, and what big." Eyes you have, all the better to see you, and what big teeth you have, all the better to eat you. <laughs> the wolf jumps up and <sighs> ah, the old man is gone. The real old man who said, "Ah, help me! Ah, help me!" The hunter hears and he run. I ah, he run, run, run. And shot the wolf, and then, and then he caught the big bad wolf. Now you in my hands. The the hunter cut the wolf belly, and rescued the rama. Thank you, Mister Hunter, Sir Red Riding Hood. Okay, say the hunter. But promise next time you don't like that. So. Little Red Riding Hood promise she will never to walk in a big bad wolf again. One day she's walking in the woods again, and then she meets the wolf who eats her grandma again. But now the wolf know what he see with the with the little Red Riding Hood. The the the, the hunter. Punish him for cleaning the woods. The end. Goodbye, everyone. See you next time. In the lesson, you must listen to your mommy. In the lesson, you need to listen to the grown-ups. The grown-ups do all the good thing for us, and we don't. Don't what the grown ups say you to do, so we will be in trouble. <laughs> trouble. Two, when we go in the woods, don't talk to strangers. No, they will. Don't. don't uh, when the surgeon tell you where you live, don't tell them. No, they will come to our house. And take some thing for our house. Three, three. When we go in the wood, we must don't go anywhere. Will be lost. We we pick some flowers, but don't go very far, so we'll be lost in the wood. So we can never return home. Goodbye, everyone. That is the lesson. Bye. Bye. Yeah.